Welcome to the Sunday Shave of the Day, Episode 2. Hey, Eric here with Adventures in Wet Shaving. And if this is your first time here and you're interested in learning how to straight razor shave, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Then hit the bell right next to it to be notified when I upload videos. That way you won't miss a thing. Alright, so now this is Episode 2 of the Sunday Shave of the Day, which means down in the description, I have got a link to Episode 1, How This Shave Began. Alright, now we're going to continue on with our Wade and Butcher for Gentleman's Juice. This is a big old beautiful honking razor, guys. Smiling blade, barber's notch, 15 sixteenths, and it's a wedge. One of my favorite razors right there. And for our soap tonight, we are using fine snake bite. This is just proving to be a marvelous soap. Its main ingredient uh, for scent would be menthol, which you would think would be overpowering, but it's not. Now, I'm also using my Omega 10,098. And it is loaded. Now, I will have uh, the ingredients for that soap and the scent profile, plus links to everything I've used in this shave in the description as well for you guys. All right, let's get going here. So now, I just want to remind you guys that on Fridays, first and third Friday of every month, I do... Uh, Friday specials, all right? So if you would have any ideas or questions that you would like to see answered on a Friday special, I would be happy to do that for you. And if I can actually film it and make a, a Friday special out of your idea or your question, then I will go ahead and give you a shout out and in the description, put a link to your channel if you have videos uploaded. That way, people can find you easily as well. All right? So, just keep those comments coming, guys. I really enjoy it. And I know I've got a uh, couple of new guys out there honing and, and getting ready to shave with a straight razor. Guys, just keep it up. You know, there is a learning curve, but it is worth it, all right? Just keep it up, and just let me know if there's any way I can help, okay? Because that's what we're here for. And also, guys, I really appreciate all my new subscribers. All you guys are just uh, really wonderful to have. Plus, you guys out there that have been around for a while and you know who you are, okay, thank you as well. All right. So now this is episode two, which means it's pass and a half. In this first pass, or second pass of the shave, I'm going to be going across the neck or across the grain on the neck and against the grain on my cheeks right through here that's going to be against the grain on my neck as well so let's get going now it's really important guys especially new guys you got to stretch okay so you're going to see my off hand always stretching Okay, looking good. Tell you what, this is really nice soap. I'm enjoying it.
yeah. So hopefully you guys are having a good weekend as well. Maybe getting in some uh, friends and family time, getting able to being able to relax. I think that is really the best. Got to have that downtime, guys. And that's actually one of the things this whole shaving with a straight razor does. Gives you downtime. They had a bump right there, looks like. Did that the other day. Maybe a couple. That's okay. All right, looking good. Yeah, you know, they're just a little tiny. A couple of little tiny ones there. Okay. Switching hands. Let's do this other side. Nice. All right, so I am going to refresh and get those little fly soap things that fly around when you're when it's starting to dry out. You know, I'm sure. At some point, I'll go, be able to go fast enough that this won't be a big deal, but yeah, no big deal. Just reload. Yeah, I'll just put on more soap.
No big deal. All right. There you go, guys. Pass to complete. Oh, yeah. Nice. Okay. And that second pass, it was a little colder. So this, this is acting like a menthol soap. However, it is not messing with my eyes at all, which is good. You know, sometimes the just the menthol fumes, it's just wow. But, you know, right now it's fine. And I'm telling you what, that soap is slick and those cheeks are in really good shape. So now this is going to be the half pass, guys. I, I found... With my face, my beard, the way I shave, I don't need full three passes. Okay? My cheeks are brilliant. They're right where they need to be. I'm not going to mess with it. Okay? But my jawline and my neck, I'm going to go primarily against the grain. All right? So... That is going to finish this off, and it's going to be wonderful. So now, here we go. This is a little unconventional, but it does work for me. Oh, yes. Nice. Yeah, and see those couple of little bumps are not a problem. They're completely gone now. Okay, switching hands. Let's do the other side. really light touch 
all you need. Let that blade do the work. Okay. There we go. All right, there it is. Another shave in the books, guys. Nice. Oh, wow. And that's a good shave. Really good shave. I mean, close. All right, let's go alum everywhere. Yeah, there we are. Yeah. Go ahead and dry that off. Next. Fine snake bite. Let's see what this is like. Okay. Got some of that going. Oh, wow. Oh, that's interesting. Hmm. That's kind of nice. It is. Wow. Okay. Kind of a menthol and, I don't know, menthol and alcohol. Interesting. Contents are flammable. <laughs> All right. Hey, thank you guys so much for watching all the way to the end. Really appreciate you and all you do for me. And that stuff is getting to my eyes now, okay? So click over here to see episode one, how this shave began. Click down here to see a video specially picked out for you. Click over here on me, subscribe, like, comment, share this video with your friends. Have a great shave and a good day. And I will see you next time on Adventures in Wet Shaving.